Imagine finding out that for 22 years you have falsely accused someone. Imagine the shock of realizing that for the past 22 years you've had misdirected anger. Shabbat Shalom. In this week's Parsha, Parsha Miketz, we read about the meeting of Joseph and his brothers. For the first time in 22 years, after the horrific kidnapping, the stripping of his clothes, throwing him into the pit, being sold down to Egypt, Joseph meets his brothers. And Joseph, for all this time, thought that there's one person to be blamed, and that is Reuben. Because Reuben was the, first, the oldest brother. It was Reuben who suggested throwing Joseph into a pit for him to die. It was Reuben whose position was usurped by Jacob when Jacob gives Joseph the coat of many colors, symbolizing leadership. So if there's any brother that Joseph would bear a grudge towards, it would be Reuben. And can, I can imagine that all those years, Joseph would have dreamed getting his back at Reuben. And here was the opportunity. The brothers in front of him, the plan to bring Jacob down to Egypt and to meet Benjamin, required the incarceration and imprisonment of one brother. That brother would be Reuben. Then, Joseph listens via the interpreter, the brothers interacting with one another. And he hears Reuben saying, I told you that, that killing our brother or selling our brother would lead to damage. You know that I put him in the pit in order to return him to our father. Joseph's world is rocked. Reuben had placed him in the pit not to kill him, but to save him and to return him to, Joseph, to Jacob. Imagine that moment when you realize that your whole philosophy your whole idea of revenge was misplaced, directed to the wrong person. And now, think about your own life. And think about positions that you've been exposed to or heard of. And ask yourself the question, maybe I don't have all the facts in front of me. Maybe my anger is misdirected. Maybe I need to research further. Because the reality is, we don't have all the facts before us. And it is only through investigation that the truth will come to light. The message and the story of Joseph and Reuben is a powerful message in understanding and learning a biblical text. It is equally powerful in terms of understanding who we are, what we believe, and whether we are, in fact, guardians of the truth or how are we being Played. Much to think about. Shabbat Shalom. Hi, this is Rabbi Lewin. If you've enjoyed the content of the sermons and the ideas that have been expressed in the YouTube video, please hit that first subscription button and notification bell and share the videos with friends. We'd love to grow the channel and love to engage with you. Please share your comments in the section below. I'd love to hear from you. Have an amazing day.